The first and easiest thing you can do is to create an automated promotion process for each new article that you publish. And I'll show you how to do that. I'm going to primarily be using a tool called Zapier. And what Zapier does is it lets you automate interactions between different web apps and tools. So if we go into Zapier, what you can see is it's got all of these apps that it's integrated with, uh, somewhere in the five or six hundreds, I think. And what it lets you do is set up automatic interactions between different apps. So what we're going to set up is a Zap. And if you don't have a Zapier account, then you can go ahead and make one. Uh, but we'll create a Zap that allows us to automatically promote our new articles. And you'll see I have one set up here, WordPress new post automation. <coughs> what this does is it takes every new post in from my WordPress and it does some automated promotion for it, particularly on Twitter and Facebook. So first it's taking an RSS feed. And if you're familiar with an RSS feed, what it does is it just follows part of your site and looks for new content. It's usually a URL like this one, your main URL slash feed. Uh, and whenever it detects a new post, it can then take that information and for example, create a new tweet on Twitter. So this is gonna create a tweet on my account and all it's doing is it's taking the title of the article and then a link to it. With Zapier, what you can do is you can pull in information from other steps. So you'll notice we can add anything we want to this tweet based on what's getting pulled in from the RSS feed. So we could add the description, we could add the entire contents of the article, you wouldn't necessarily want to do that. Uh, but it gives you the ability to use any information from the start of the Zap in the resulting action. So this will automatically tweet out uh, my articles and then this one will do the same thing by posting on my Facebook page. So you can connect your Facebook page and then you can create a default template for it where every time this RSS feed triggers and there's a new article, it automatically gets shared on your Facebook page with a link to that new article. Now you'll notice I've also got a couple of Trello actions here. And what those are doing is they're actually adding Trello cards for my VA who then goes and does some other promotion on the content. A lot of it is stuff that I'm going to show you in the other videos, so you don't need to worry about that too much right now. But obviously, if you do have someone who helps you with this, then adding another step into your Zap to create these tasks for them is really helpful so that you never have to remember to go create the tasks yourself. So Zapier will help a lot with getting your post out to social media as soon as you publish it. Uh, and you can connect a lot of other social media services. I primarily just use Facebook and Twitter, but if you spend some time with Zapier, you'll see like just how many apps they have connected uh, for almost everything that you would want to use. There's some that you can't really do like Instagram because they block web access, but obviously we've got Pinterest here. You can use Buffer to publish multiple places, LinkedIn. You've got a lot of options. So setting this up will really help with getting some of your initial promotion just running on autopilot.